So, I've been thinking on how I can practice my culinary skills. I thought making lunch for you here and there might be a good way to practice. Would that be alright? Oh, I'm so glad. I'll give it everything I've got. And I think you'll like what's in store. One look at how exhausted you are, and I can see just how hectic things have been. How about a shoulder massage to help take the edge off a little? No problem. Don't hesitate to lean on me if you need something like this, alright? Oh yeah, I spritzed on some perfume for once. I tried picking a fragrance that you might like. So, did I nail it? It's... It's embarrassing having you sniff me so much. But that means I really did nail it at least. <laughs> I have to say, you look even more rugged than you used to. Maybe it's because you're only in shorts, but my eyes can't help but wander your way. Excuse me, I really shouldn't be doing or saying things like that, should I? I can keep looking? It doesn't make you at all uncomfortable if I stare? In that case... Oh no! Let's please drop this and move on! There are children here, like Kia! I can't act this way! Seriously... It's funny. All I'm doing is sitting here and yet I feel so content. Like there's nothing to fear in this world. <sighs> What am I even saying? I must sound like a complete lunatic. Really? If you're sure. Calm down, Ellie. What good will it do being bashful over every little thing you say? I hate to interrupt our conversation, but we should probably get to that drink. I'd hate for Machette's efforts to go to waste. But this means our faces will be fairly close to one another's, doesn't it? No. No buts. I can't chicken out now. Ahem. <clears throat> Why don't I get us started? Excuse me, but I would appreciate it if you didn't hone in on my boobs. W what? This is how you're supposed to drink it. You know, this drink is actually kind of fun. Hmm, come on, Lloyd. I know it might be inevitable in this position, but still, I'm so sweaty and gross right now anyway. Lloyd, you're making me antsy with all your staring. It's hard enough to drink this as nervous as I am. Don't make it worse, okay? You know, <laughs> this drink is actually kind of fun. We have so much to protect. I know we can't afford to let personal feelings get in the way, but it's difficult. I really am happiest spending time with you like this. So, it's fine to look at me. In fact, even if it's just for this moment, I want you to keep your eyes only on me. Can you do that? Thank you, Lloyd. And in return, I'll always keep my eyes on you. Too. That was a really satisfying way to spend our time. It helped reaffirm where we both stand. <laughs> that couple's drink was also a fun pinch of spice to sprinkle over the moment. If the chance ever presents itself again, well, I'd love to share another one with you. That's great! I'm already looking forward to it.
about that. It's not because I'm bored, just so you know. It's more I'm comfortable. Almost too comfortable, it would seem. Well, if you're so fine with it, I'll have to make myself extra cozy. Just don't mind it if I end up leaning on you mid-nap, all right? I don't know why, but I kept getting a strange amount of attention while playing beach volleyball earlier. It was especially bad whenever I jumped. Did my hair keep falling out of place funny, you think? My chest? Oh! This is so awkward. I thought Elia was a little too excited when helping me pick out my swimsuit. Too late to worry about it now, I guess. I appreciate you being honest with me, Lloyd. Thanks. I feel so safe being next to you, Lloyd. Not that anyone from Arkansas makes me feel unsafe. They're family. But uh, how to put this? Could I come a little closer? <laughs> Good answer. I know that may have come across as forward, but I wanted to shoot my shot. Mm, still bothering me. See, it feels a little tight around my chest for some reason. Maybe I should have gone up a size. I'm debating whether or not to put up with it or to go buy another top at one of the shops. You sure it's fine as is? If you say so, why do I get that you're saying it's fine for all the wrong reasons? I could have sworn I put on enough sunscreen, but my back is already starting to feel tingly. I wonder when will be a good time to ask someone to help me put on more. You would do that for me? Um, well... Sure, I'd really appreciate it. Huh? Our drinks came with some sort of note. How bold! I ought to take a page out of Michette's book. I know she meant this as a romantic gesture for us, but if there's another girl you have in mind, Lloyd, I don't mind. It's okay. I wouldn't want you to feel put out on my account. Um, Lloyd? You really didn't have to do this, you know? Um... I really do think they would look much prettier on someone else. I don't know if I deserve something so nice. L Lloyd? If you stare too much, you'll... Um, Lloyd? Are you sure I should be the one to wear them? Lloyd? If you stare too much, you'll... I'm so fortunate that my job lets me wear so many gorgeous costumes, and all tailor-made for me. So, what is it about you putting a few flowers on me that makes me so happy? I promise I'll take such good care of them. Thank you, Lloyd, so much. Thanks again for the flowers, too. Now to find the perfect outfit to go with them. Not as much as you think. These are special, you know. I bet Sansan will have some good ideas. I'll ask for her input.
I was up till late last night reading this new thesis, so I'm a bit tired. If I end up passing out on the beach, I better not learn you were watching me when I wake up. I appreciate it. It'd be... awkward if you did it while I was wearing this. It's been a minute since I've had a chance to unwind. It's strange to think of how much I've come to think of Crossbell as home. I don't know if you realized, but the SSS has been at it for three years. Amazing to think that we've known each other for that long already. So much has happened since its formation, and I wouldn't trade my experiences through it for anything. I got to take a picture with Mishy earlier. You should get one too, Lloyd. Anyone who does it today also gets a special hug from him. There is no greater source of joy to be found in Zemiria than in Mishy's arms. I'll even be the one to snap the photo for you two if you want. Just let me know. I got a letter from my parents saying that they were hoping to see you, Lloyd. You think you could swing me that favor? You're a lifesaver. They can be such worry warts. I'm lucky I have you to help me get them off my back. <laughs> you know, you have a pretty sturdy frame, Lloyd. You look... a lot like how I remember Guy. And everyone trusts you just as much as they did him. That's why I also... Actually, never mind. Feeling kind of wiped. Too much fun going on today. Wait, what's this letter? So I'm your special squeeze, huh? She's been putting in some work to make us a thing. Lloyd, what should we do? I think we have a situation here. Well? Turning back now, I guess. <laughs> Let's uh, make the most of this. Nice work, Machette. Huh? You're getting off track. Hurry up and put them on. Um, Lloyd? Just. Make it quick. It's almost as nice as wearing an engagement ring. Uh, are they r really that nice? Can't believe this is happening. This is uh, more than a little awkward. You know, this isn't so bad. In fact, I don't know if I've ever felt this good. That said, I don't think this is where it should end. I'm already 17. Don't you think I deserve a reward for playing along with this whole thing? Then I want you to stroke my hair. And don't do it like I'm a kid. Do it like the woman I'm becoming. This feels... Really nice. I'm so glad today happened. All told, this has been pretty great. The hair stroking was a nice end of day bonus. Even if you still did it like I'm the little girl you met years ago. Looks like I'll have to wait another day before you give me just what I want.
could today be any better for hanging out here? It's like it's asking for you to take a swim. If you're up for it later, how about we rent some bikes and take in the scenery together? All right! I can't wait! I always get a rush out of a good ride. Hate to say it, but I get jealous of how easy it is for Fran to make friends and how cute she is. I wish I could be more like her. You ever wish you could change yourself too? You think so? So I'm okay as I am then? If that's what you think, then what am I even working myself up over? Uh, I want your honest opinion about something, if you don't mind. Do I look good in this? Perfect? That good? <laughs> Way to talk me up. I was worried it was too modest, but if you're into it, then that's good enough for me. Detective Bannings, I've got an important question. It's, uh, it's, can I scooch a little closer to you? Score! <laughs> Sorry, but I had to ask. It can't hurt to indulge myself once in a while, yeah? Sorry, I didn't mean to stare like that. I was just thinking how long it's been since we've spent some quality time together. Uh, <laughs> I must sound so clingy right now. Just ignore me. So you were thinking the same thing then? <laughs> I feel pretty darn flattered when you say it to me, so maybe it's not so clingy after all. Hmm, no wonder this stuff is so popular. Taste and texture are just to die for. By the way, Lloyd, Fran told me to try something out. She said if I ever ordered bubble tea, then I had to take a selfie with it. It's just a hot thing people do now. And if I'm gonna take a selfie for her, well, could you take it with me? Where do you think you're looking? Oh, Adios, his face is so close. I, uh, think this angle works, don't you? Yes, all guys really are the same. It's all right with me since it's you, but just try not to spread that around to others. Uh, aren't you staring a little too much, Lloyd? I can already picture Fran losing it after seeing us together. Completely worth the ear-splitting squeals and barrage of questions for an exclusive shot with you, of course. I was trying to play it smooth, but then you saying it's got me all kinds of flustered now. Guess I'm not so smooth after all, huh? I'm thinking I'll keep this in my uniform's breast pocket as a good luck charm. Keeping such a warm memory close to my heart will be a surefire way of helping me stay positive through even the toughest hours. I just know it. <laughs> Consider it payback for always pulling the same thing on me, mister.
Uh, instructor, those eyes aren't wandering where they aren't supposed to, right? <laughs> Good. That's a relief to hear. So, instructor, have you been able to kick back enough while at Michelin? Good. <laughs> that does the cross and in me proud. Honestly, how are you so calm about all this? Do I just not have that it factor that drives a guy wild? Oh, wow. I, I figured you'd be polite at most, but I didn't think you'd, uh, bat for me that hard. Hey, instructor? Do you mind if I scooch a little closer to you? Cool. Th thanks. D don't get the wrong idea. I just want easy access to our drink is all. So, about my bikini. I tried picking out something a little more outside my comfort zone. Do you think it works for me? <laughs> Good. Uh, just don't ogle too much, okay? <sighs> okay. I think I worked up the nerve. Instructor Reen? I want to try tackling this drink together. Just, um, try not to move or anything, okay? Okay, okay. Whew. I'm ready. Huh? What is it? Do I got something on my face? This drink's a lot even for two, isn't it? <laughs> I... Hey! Where do you think you're looking? Focus on the drink, damn it! Oh, you just don't know when to quit, do you? Oh, come on! <sighs> At least I've got his undivided attention for now. staring any time. Drink in less of me and more of this mocktail. This drink's a lot even for two, isn't it? <laughs> you just don't know when to quit, do you? Oh, come on. At least I've got his undivided attention for now. Um, instructor, you can't hear my heart pounding right now, can you? It's only like that because I was moving around so much earlier. It's got nothing to do with shot nerves from being near you, okay? Ah, uh, I'm dying. Why is this happening to me? Although, instructor, is it just me, or are you a little too happy, even for a guy on vacation? <laughs> Fine. I'll let you play dumb for now. At least I know for sure I'm not half bad of a catch in your eyes now.
helpless without me, aren't you, instructor? Oops. I got so comfortable that I dozed off. I didn't say anything funny in my sleep, did I? <sighs> Your eyes say otherwise, but I respect that you were trying to be considerate of my feelings. As for what kind of dream I was having, I think I'll keep that to myself. It's not just swimming I've been interested in. I found myself wanting to draw outside of our art classes more and more as well. In fact, I think I'd like to sketch out our vacation here so I can share it with everyone once we're back. You don't seem to like the idea much. Why? Because you want this kept specially between us? Honestly, Instructor. I get this feeling that after the Great Twilight ended, my body started to age like normal. Do you think I'll ever become a full-grown woman? You're starting to make me blush. It would make me very happy if you remained by my side, to see me become that woman one day. I don't understand what it is about this situation that puts me so at ease. Is it less to do with where I'm at, and more to do with who is next to me? you feel the same way? Then if you're okay with it, I'd like to stay like this for a while longer. I noticed Milliam prefers clothing that makes more of a bold statement. Her swimsuit seems especially provocative. Don't you think she should try dressing a bit more modestly like me? Does showing any amount of skin strike you as risque? Strange. I think what I'm wearing for the occasion is very practical. Just take me wearing this around you as... as a way of saying you make me feel safe. Um. Uh, this is more filling than I expected. Now I get what Milliam meant when she said this drink was addicting. I really do enjoy the overall sweetness with the chewy texture. She also told me that people like to take what they call selfies with them. She sent me her own selfies, and she keeps bugging me to send one back. If you wouldn't mind, would you want to be in my first selfie? I appreciate you trying this out with me. My goal is to take one at least as nice as hers. Are you sure you want photographic evidence of your outlandish depravity for all to see? Instructor, please face the camera. Hmm, it's hard to get an optimal angle on an Arcus unit. Ah, <sighs> there isn't much point in staring there. If you really feel so inclined, though, look away. You're harmless enough. It's, um, awkward with you staring at me. Hmm, it's hard to get an optimal angle on an Arcus unit. I never thought I would be the type to want to do things like this. It's like, not a day goes by now that I don't learn something new about myself. There's nothing wrong with having so many sides, is there? Thank you, Instructor. None of this would even be possible without the friends I've made. And you. I realize you're a very busy man, but the next time you can, 
Would you be open to spending another day with me doing ordinary things like we did? We shall see. <laughs> By the way, what do you think of my bikini? I tried to pick out one that would appeal to your tastes. Good. And since I've succeeded so well, it would be a shame for you not to take a good long look while it's just the two of us. Do you prefer me with long hair when I act as Mildine? I've been thinking of growing it out, but I'm a bit conflicted. So you can't imagine me without this cut? That does add to the temptation to keep it as is. <laughs> You're such a sweetie. I really love how built your back muscles are. Think you could indulge me a little and let me rub sunscreen on them later? You want to rub sunscreen on... on me? Instruct her? What am I supposed to say when you turn on the charm without warning? It's not often that I get to be alone with you. I need to make the most of this time while I can. Why, I've already devised a number of schemes to claim those luscious lips for myself. What? You want me to go for it? I wasn't expecting you to be so forward. <laughs> I need some time to... It was a joke? <laughs> How could you toy with such an innocent heart? But then again, I'd be lying if I said I don't love it when you're a tease. <laughs> I wonder if Princess Alfin and Elise are curious about what's going on over here. I hate to spoil the moment, but we may have to turn our couple's evening into a group outing. You really want to be with me that much? Alright, how could I say no to those puppy dog eyes? Well, I think it's time I helped myself to our drink. Don't hesitate to help yourself at the same time, instructor. Now this is paradise. I never dreamed I'd share a moment so intimate with my beloved. Though I wasn't expecting to have our faces be quite this close. But never mind that. Ready to see if it's as tasty as it looks? Oh, has something caught your fancy, instructor? <laughs> Did I get some on my face? Working on this drink with you really gets my heart going. My, you're so bold today! It's just you and me. So feel free to take it all in. We're almost nose to nose. What a blessed turn of events. Oh, I hope he can't hear my heart pounding. Working on this drink with you really gets my heart going. <laughs> this drink is so delicious. I was hoping it would cool me down after how I mentioned being so hot earlier. But it is what it is with you, huh? No, don't answer. I don't think I'd like what I'd hear. Just once, won't you think of me as more than a simple, bright-eyed girl? Oh, I've misunderstood? So you do think of me as more? I can't believe this. That's what happens when you play it a little too cool. All the more reason for me to keep pushing your buttons, I suppose. I'll keep at it until you can take it no more and make your move, for as long as it takes.
Personally, I couldn't have been happier. I got to see just how much you care about me. <laughs> Careful what you say now, instructor. You never know when I'll elect to read into it a little too much. This weather is almost too perfect. If I get any more relaxed, I might just doze off and ruin our quality time together. It's okay. You don't mind watching me sleep? <laughs> Come on, Rain, get a grip. We've sure been through the ringer together, haven't we? Talking to me must come as naturally to you by now as breathing. I'd be more surprised if you couldn't relax around me. Though I think I'd be kind of flattered, too. Anyway, Reen, you haven't invited any other ladies to sit down for drinks with you here, have you? Oh, yeah? Just me, huh? It's kind of nice to know you've got your eye on me. The sun's brighter than I was expecting. I hope I put on enough sunscreen. You wouldn't mind helping me apply some more, would you? Can't hide those nerves to save your life, can you? You know, it was Sharon who helped me pick out this swimsuit, but don't you think it's kind of racy? I knew it wasn't just me. That means you like it though, right? So she was on to something. What's this? It looks like our order came with some kind of note. Okay, that explains the flowers, I guess. I would have preferred if Machette minded her own business. Um, <clears throat> anyway, what should we do about these? <laughs> this bracelet is actually really cute. I like it. Can you think of anywhere else I could wear them? What are you looking at? I adore these flowers as accessories. I could get used to wearing this. Hmm? What's the matter? Rain! You dope. <laughs> I'll let it slide, but you better not pull that again. You know, I've always thought it but you really do have the most beautiful eyes. I might just get lost in them if I stare too long. <laughs> I adore these flowers as accessories. I could get used to wearing this. It, um, does feel a little outside of my comfort zone though. What do you think? Do they look good on me? You knew just what I wanted to hear. Thanks. Getting decked out in flowers was a lot of fun too. Honestly, I've got no complaints about today. All we really did was veg out and talk but that's just what I needed. Of course, I'd love to even.
Before I forget, I cook some food to share with everyone. Would... would you be willing to take the first bite and tell me what you think? <laughs> Great! I think you'll find I've honed my skills in the kitchen quite a bit. Father and Klaus have told me that the way to a man's heart is through his stomach. Uh, nev never mind that. Since we're here, why don't we race to that island after we're done? <laughs> You'll miss out on the view? You can't mean me in my swimsuit. <laughs> Honestly, you can be so audacious. I've noticed you sneaking a few glances my way. Is my swimsuit that distracting? <laughs> I wasn't expecting you to give such a sheepish reply. I suppose I'd do the same thing though, wouldn't I? We may have trained together countless times, but it's nice to be able to sit and do nothing with you as well. I'm glad it's not just me. You're, um... You're more than welcome to sit closer, if you like. Reen, could I get a feel for how toned your muscles are at the moment? Huh, they feel so tight. You've remained steadfast in your training. Oh, uh, f forgive me. This is inappropriate, isn't it? Alright, I've made up my mind. I say, it's time we had at this cocktail. Oh, if only his face wasn't going to be so close. Oh, whatever. We can drink this in one fell swoop, no problem. <gasps> Reen, where are you looking? Please try to take this exercise seriously. I know I most certainly am. Oh, please don't stare so intently, Reen. Keep your focus on the drink. Hmm. The manner in which you drink it may be mortifying, but it's still rather delicious. Reen, I swear. I suppose at the end of the day, you're still a man like any other. R Reen, please. Oh, fine. Look wherever you like. Just help finish this quickly. R Reen, I've almost had as much of this as I can reasonably handle. If it's all the same to you, I, I suggest we keep our eyes closed until we finish. Does that work? What? Actually, you may have a point. Chances like this don't come along every day. It's true that if there's anyone I'd be happiest doing this with, it's you. You know what? You're right. I liked seeing a new side of you, too. Even if everything you saw today isn't something I'm generally keen on sharing with others. You're not just an other to me. You're special. Did I? I, I didn't mean to, exactly. So I hope I didn't make you uncomfortable. My work as a wandering witch obviously takes me all over the place. But even after all I've seen, new sights like this still manage to take my breath away. Do you like to travel too, Reen? 
like it enough to want to travel together? I, I'd love that, to be honest. There's so much I'd want to show you if we ever got the chance. It's been so long since we've all been able to spend time together like this. It takes me back to when we were at Thor's. Do you ever wish you could go back to those days, Reen? So do I. It wasn't without its rough patches, but we made a lot of fun memories back then, too. My favorite one has to be when we were alone in the dorm when... You know what? Let's change the subject! I had Grandmother help pick out this swimsuit with me, but... A white bikini makes me stick out like a sore thumb, doesn't it? So it looks fine? Oh, phew. That's a relief. Even if I just realized you had to get a good look at it to tell me that. Ah, oh, everything is so nice and calm here. It's selfish to say, but I wish we could stay like this forever. Oh, I know. I know. This time is precious because it won't last forever. We have to make it count. Oh, no. My skin's starting to sting. It might be about time to reapply sunscreen. You'll put it on for me? Adios, I... That might be a little too much for... No, go for it, Reen. That would be great. I didn't think adding the tapioca balls would make such a big difference, but it really does. By the way, if you don't mind, would you be okay with taking a picture with our bubble tea to remember today? Grandmother would not stop hounding me about taking a picture that was goals or something like that, so... I hope it's just my mind playing tricks on me, but you're not looking where you aren't supposed supposed to be looking, are you? Sorry for dragging you into this, Reen. Um, do you think this angle will work? I knew it! You are looking at my chest! We're, we're in public, I hope you remember. Would you stop ogling me so much? It's rude! Uh, do I look okay for it? Stare so hard and it'll make me blush harder. Ah, that should do it. Sorry again, Reen. So, if it's not too much to ask, would you also be okay with me putting this photo in my notebook as a keepsake? That way I can look at it and think of you during my travels. Phew, I was hoping you'd be okay with it. Now I can always look at it during my travels and think of my time spent with you. Sure, I'll be sure to pass them on. I know we took this for her. But a part of me wants to keep it all to myself now. Oh, nothing. I was just lost in thought for a second. And I'd like to extend the same invitation to you. If you need some indulging yourself, I'm here for you. first joined Thoris. I never thought you and me would be like family. I'm, uh, I'm still part of your family, right, Reen? I'm more now? You're just not gonna elaborate on that? <laughs> Jerk. Be straight with me. 
Do I look good right now? I kinda picked the first bikini I saw, but... I don't know if I got the curves for this one. Yeah? Well, if it's good enough for you, Rain. And you look good too, you know. You know, my cheeks are starting to turn red. Gee, wonder why I feel so warm when my drink's so cool. <laughs> so you get it. Your face is even redder than mine. Guess we'll both need to cool off before we head back. You know how you tend to rub girls' heads sometimes when you want to soothe them? You used to do it to me a lot too, but to be honest, I'd feel more like a kid to you if you kept it up now. Thanks for understanding. Glad you get it. I don't mean you have to stop stop for the record. I might miss it if you did. So, how's it feel to be in your 20s? I've still got a couple years to go. Can't come soon enough. In due time, compadre. I'll be hitting the big 2-0 before you know it. We'll have our celebratory drinking session then... Maybe after I... I wasn't sure how I'd feel about bubble tea, but it's pretty good. Nice and filling. If it wasn't so heavy, it'd make for good rations. Oh yeah, you know anything about that fad that has people taking selfies with bubble tea? Zeno dragged Leo into one. The pic they sent me had them all cozied up to each other. Think you'd be up for sending one like theirs right back to them? You trying to creep? Rain, I can't take a good shot if you look that way. Hmm, this is pretty tricky. Mine's scooching in, Rain. I should have known that's where you'd keep those eyes occupied. Lucky for you, you get a pass. Just look at the camera once you're good. Uh, Reen, your face is a little too close. I can hear your heartbeat from here doing this. Do you hear mine? Wow, you really can? That's kind of embarrassing. But I feel so comfortable here at the same time. Comfortable enough that I wish we could be like this forever. I've been so busy with guild work that this was the perfect way for me to finally unwind. Chilling with you really makes it feel like I'm right back at Thor's. Yeah. As long as I've got you rooting me on, there's nothing I can't do. I'm only a few years ahead, but man, it feels more like I'm a few decades when I'm hanging with you guys. Your skin loses all its perk and pep, and next thing you know, you're the token old gal of the gang. Bold words from a younger man, but I don't mind the fine wine perspective. <laughs> I'd say it's fair to call you a heartbreaker, Reen. You're hanging with me now, but I'm sure you've wooed many a doe-eyed doll this way before. What? How many guys have I wooed? 
I don't know what you're imagining, but I haven't had enough boyfriends to call myself a... Ah, just, just shut your face. You know, I used to only go for handsome, rugged, older men. Never in my life did I expect to do a full 180. It's crazy. You don't think so? Or do you mean... It's not so crazy falling for you? Whew. Running around on the beach sure is one way to work up a hell of a stinky sweat. You don't want to cozy up to this bod anytime soon. You think I actually smell nice that way? What kind of little freak are you? Well, there are worse things to be into. I gotta know, Reen. Do you think this look is hot? <laughs> Thanks. Hmm. If I knew you'd like it this much, I would have upped the sexy some more. Well, seeing as we don't have all day here, we might as well get a move on with this drink. Looks pretty sweet. Or so I say, but diving into this whole couple's shebang is nerve-wracking. Ugh, the hell am I getting so worked up over? I'm the older one here. Anywho, let's drink up. Men will be men, I suppose. I'll give you the okay, but only for today. G come on, you're like right here. You don't need to stare like that. There's a lot left. You better be drinking your share too, Reen. You're acting like you just hit puberty, I swear. Whatever. Better enjoy that okay from me while it lasts. Ah, <sighs> you never were that good at taking instruction. You're, uh, getting a little too close there. Keep this up and everyone will start thinking we're a thing. What? You don't care if they do? At all? I hate how much he can still rattle me. <laughs> Sounds like your old instructor needs to straighten you out again, huh? Though the real monster here is you, you sure go hard when talking to women, don't you? Just don't think you'll always have the upper hand with me. I know a few things that are sure to make you blush. Uh-huh. Well, if you're thinking of spending more time with me, next time we're going out for the real drinks. We're gonna get so plastered, they'll have to peel us off the floor and toss our asses out in the dirt. to know what the future has in store, but whatever that may be, I... I hope you'll always be there with me. Thanks, Rain. It's kind of silly needing to hear it out loud though, huh? You'll be staying in Ymir for a while after this, right? I'm envious. Those hot springs are paradise. We made so many great memories soaking in the open air and foot baths. I hope I can do it again sometime. Hey, do most guys, you know, prefer women who are more stacked? Really? So it's not so bad to be flat, huh? 
I hope that's what you prefer, too. You've gotten so tall, Reen. Now I can't reach up and rub your head when I like. <sighs> I'm sorry! That might have come across weird. <laughs> Thanks for helping me save face. Little things like that make a girl feel special around you. I'm so glad your hair went back to normal. Your silver hair was handsome, but honestly, what you have now looks more dignified and manly. I... I think it's perfect for you. You don't think so? Oh, come on, Reen. You don't have to be so humble. I hope he doesn't think what I said was weird. I... I can feel my face starting to heat up. Sorry, I need a sip of your drink. It looks like our drinks came with a letter. Say what? These flowers are... And what's this about a special squeeze? Rain, what should we do? Well... Um... If it's not too much to ask, could you... maybe put more in my hair? Embarrassing. Hey, mister! Where are you looking? Keep up that funny business and I'll get mad! <sighs> They're so pretty, aren't they? Well, I guess I don't mind with you. Watching you know. They make me feel pretty too. As pretty as a bride. <laughs> Maybe Michette's little scheme wasn't so bad after all. Yeah. Thanks, Reen. I'll treasure these flowers. I actually feel so much better that I hate having to call it quits already. But it could be worse. Just means I know how much to look forward to the next time. Are you saying the bar was set low? <sighs> you know what? Don't answer. It's okay. feel so at ease whenever I'm beside you, Reen. Remember when I used to treat you as more of an older brother? I think I rather miss doing that. Alas! But I understand completely. If the title must only belong to Elise, then so be it. She does a wonderful job anyhow. Oliver's wedding ceremony truly was beautiful. Do you think I'll have the pleasure of walking down the aisle like him one day? Are you saying? Oh, Reen. You can be so charmingly forward. 
Would you mind if I sat a little closer to you, Reen? Good. Because I simply must have you all to myself right now. If I may go on a bit of a tangent, Reen, do you think this swimsuit looks... pretty on me? Oh, thank goodness. I wanted you to like it. I did pick it out with you in mind, after all. Sometimes I think to myself, if I weren't a princess, wouldn't our relationship be something more by now? So the obstacles in our way make us spicier then? You may be onto something. <laughs> You've lit a fire in my heart just by saying that. Mmm. Oh, this soft and chewy texture is divine. I think I feel an addiction coming on. The drink isn't the only thing I want to try, however. My classmates mentioned that one must take a commemorative photo with it before it's finished. Particularly nice photos like these are fire, I think they called it. I wonder what a cold drink has to do with heat. Anyhow, I was hoping you could join me in my little commemorative photo. Would you be so kind? Rain? Uh, oh! Pretend you didn't notice, Elfin! <laughs> Rain? Aw, oh, what's the matter? Let's hope this photo is fire. Uh, I hate to be a bother, but this really is embarrassing. Honestly, I had my doubts you could display such lascivious behavior, but look at you now. <laughs> Not that I mind being the target of your naughtier side. It's... Hard not to blush when we're so close. I want you to know how happy I am right now. You're a gentleman to me, the princess I am. As much as you're kind to me, the ordinary girl I am at heart. Though, as much as I love to dream of caving to romance, I must retain my composure. You don't mind if I'm not everyone's ideal image of a princess? Thank you for everything. If it weren't for you, I'd... I'll look upon it fondly and think of what a wonderful time I had with you. I can still feel myself going flush at the thought of everything we did. My pleasure. popular at St. Astraea as the Ashen Chevalier. I can't tell you how often I get asked for your autograph. I know you used to have mixed feelings about your fame, but I hope you've been able to accept it with time. That's good. I'm happy to hear it. Although, when I think about you embracing your popularity with other women... I'm the one with mixed feelings. 
I'm not sure I've grown much in the last few years, even if I'd like to think I did. I need to do better as the daughter of a baron, and as a sister worthy of you. I'm already a fine woman, you say? <laughs> oh, thank you. I'm so pleased you think that. I picked out this swimsuit with Her Highness just for today. Do I look all right in it? <laughs> thank you, Rain. It's not the easiest one to wear, but I wanted you to see it. I know it sounds terrible, but I've thought about what my life would be like if... If you hadn't joined our family all those years ago, do you ever try to imagine it? <laughs> I suppose how we are now is more than second nature after all these years. You don't know how happy it makes me that you and I are family. Or so I say, but a part of me does selfishly want more than that. Say, Reen, I'd like to get a closer look at your chest if it won't make you too uncomfortable. It looks like your scar is much better these days. I'm glad it stopped hurting. You know, you've become so muscular since we were lit- Oops, touching you so much was, um, inappropriate. Please, forget it. This non-alcoholic cocktail is delicious. I can't wait to try a real alcoholic drink with you. Not much longer now. What's this? Our drinks came with this letter. I'm your special squeeze? How, um, shall we address this, Reen? Are you sure you want me to wear these? They feel like such a waste on... Even if I do appreciate you giving me them. Reen? Oh, oh! Why did you have to ruin the mood? I can't look you in the eyes right now. <laughs> I can feel myself blushing. I'd like it if you didn't stare, but if you can't resist, then I'll just have to put on my bravest face. Rain, please. You're teasing me so much. <laughs> Don't mind me. I was just remembering something. From when we were little. You gave me flowers to wear just like these. I know Machette is simply having her fill of fun over this, but it's helped to evoke such a lovely memory. It still brings me so much joy. I never thought I'd get to experience it again. If there's a next time, I'd like it if you did it in a more... Oh, never mind. Though, to be honest, I was hoping you would be a little more forward. <laughs> Don't worry about it. It just means I know how you work now. I'll be taking more advantage of the fact that we're siblings. And if worse comes to worse, I can always take a few pointers out of Muse's playbook. <laughs>